Hi, I'm Sean McGuire. I'm a professional planner and economic developer from upstate New York, and we're here to talk about Tableau. Uh, Tableau is a wonderful piece of software that has been well adopted in private industry, and we're seeing uh, a real opportunity to use it here in the field of planning. For years, I mean, planners like myself and, and like you have been using products like Excel to display and present data to their clients and to the public. However, we have a lot of new tools that are available at our disposal uh, to present that same data in a dynamic and interactive format. First, what is Tableau? And how is it different from some of the ways we've presented data in the past? Well, like I said before, Tableau isn't a replacement for Microsoft Excel. It's really an enhancement. Most of us have used Excel for years to collect, organize, and display information. And Excel has been a fine solution for creating plans and reports that are pr printed and remain static. However, data is constantly changing. Many of us deal with data that is changing on a monthly basis, like unemployment data, on a quarterly basis, such as cost of living index data, or annually, like data from the American Community Survey, or on an even longer basis, uh, such as 10-year census data. And if you're like me, you publish this data in a lot of formats, not only in print, but in social media and on your websites. And this is where Tableau is best suited, in an, env in an environment where you are connecting with different sources of data that is regularly updated and shared with others. Excel has limited options for data connectivity as well. With Tableau, we'll use Excel to manage our raw data only. And instead of using Excel to build static charts and graphs, We'll build them in Tableau where they'll be dynamic and interactive. So over the next hour, we'll talk about data in general, get oriented to the Tableau environment, and use that data to build our first worksheet. Tableau offers a new opportunity for planners in how we present data and information. Dashboards have become the norm in business, and now we're seeing them more and more in our work. So let's get to work.